Welcome to Victorian Gardens Cattery and Perry Winkle's Nursery. She has two babies. Um, they were born on the 22nd of September 2018. They just turned into their second 14 day, two weeks. And they just, the little calico just opened her eyes today. This little girl is a, <coughs> she's either a blue point or a seal point <coughs> by color Hemi. You can see her white paws. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> so they're just starting to move around. <coughs> I don't know if you can see her back there. She's gorgeous. Let's see if she'll let us turn her over. Yeah, say hi. This is our first calico. <coughs> She's a doll. She just opened, started opening her eyes yesterday. So she, <coughs> she was a little late in opening her eyes. This one's walking all the way over here. I think this one's a blue point. Blue point hemi. So you can already see the white paw pads. You looking for your mommy? <coughs> she started walking yesterday. I mean, just starting. And we're looking at keeping her as a breeder. Love her markings. She almost looks like a tiger back here. Mommy's being really good. Good mommy. She's been low on milk. She's eating, so just having them. Um, Low, low, lower portion of milk. And we've been giving her medicine to make it her milk production to go up. I don't know that it's helped all that much, but so this is Periwinkle's nursery, and we wanted to give a video before it gets too long, uh, too far. I mean, they've grown up so much already. But we've just been extremely busy, busy, busy here. So we're going to get this loaded up so everybody can see our new calico and our new litter. Okay, so Periwinkle was in a nursing cage with her babies. And yesterday she moved them out because I left the screen open for her to get out. And she moved them. And every time I put them back, she moves them again. So I took it all down <laughs> because she was telling me she didn't want her babies in there anymore, that they were getting ready to walk, and she wanted them to have the space. So what we've done is we've, underneath here, and we have a receiving blanket on top, and then um, a padded memory foam uh, reflector for heat to keep them warm and then underneath that we have a towel and then along the sides we have towels built up to keep them in this little area. You know, in probably a week they'll be outside of the area but we want them to, they'll be moved in about a, a week and a half. They're going to be moved down to the toddler room so that Iris's boy isn't all by himself because uh, Petunia's litter will be leaving. 
so he'd be the only one in there. So we're going to move these babies down, and by then they'll be like three and a half weeks. So that, that'll be great. Plus we have a new litter that'll be due right around the same time. So we always stay busy here. <laughs> it's, it's always um, musical chairs. So anyway, we'll say goodbye for now from Victorian Gardens Cattery and Petunia's, uh, Periwinkle's Nursery. And we are actually in the nursery. And her two Persian and Himalayans, um, a calico girl on the left and a bicolor Hemi on the right. And she's a girl also. So bye for now.